In this video, I'm gonna be talking all about Cresco software. If you haven't heard of Cresco, it's an equivalent payment service to things like Stripe. Now, Cresco don't actually make branded tops, hoodies, but I asked them for one because I was gonna be making this video and they have sent me this really comfy sweatshirt, which I love. And they've also sent me this little tiny cactus. Look how little it is. I thought it would be useful to actually talk through a demonstration of implementing Cresco rather than me just sat here chatting about how great it is. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to set it up for my coaching business. And I haven't done this for a while because the first time I set it up was for Smooth and that was about a month ago. So I've completely forgotten how to do it. I want to show you authentically how easy it is to set up Cresco so you can do it for your business. Just a little disclaimer, I am not sponsored by Cresco. I do not have any affiliation with them other than the fact I am a customer and I thoroughly enjoy their product. I first heard about Cresco on LinkedIn when another accountant that I'm connected with put a post on saying how great it was, easy to use, and not only that, completely free. As I mentioned, it's very similar to Stripe, but without the fees and also you get paid instantly. What more could you want? Up until now, I've been using Stripe for my coaching business to collect payments from my customers. So my invoices go out from zero every month and my clients can click on the pay now link, which enables them to pay using Stripe. I then get paid a few days later. I think it's about seven days later once Stripe have taken their fees out. With Cresco, my invoices will go out in exactly the same way on Xero, and I'm gonna show you how to link it up. And there will still be a pay now button on the invoice, but it will take the client through to their online banking and they will then click to pay. It's really, really simple. And that was really important to me. When I was setting up Cresco, the most important thing was that it was super easy for my clients to use. I literally want people to be thinking they wanna pay me and their money just leaves their account. That's how easy I want it to be. Most of us know that Stripe make it super easy for people to pay. I have found, having used Cresco already on my accounting business, that it's just as easy for clients to pay. There's still a pay now button, but because Cresco don't hold funds, they literally just open a pathway for open banking. You get paid straight away. And like I said, absolutely no fees. So it's win-win. Now, when things are free, I don't know about you, but I'm always a bit skeptical. Like what is the catch? How can you offer this for free? How are you making any money? I don't understand. So I asked all of these questions to Cresco and I was pleasantly surprised by their response. Yes, they offer it for free because they don't hold money. So they don't need to charge for actually holding money. They're purely just opening a pathway for online banking, but they are also developing a number of other products which will be chargeable in the future. So it makes sense from a marketing perspective and building their brand that they offer this particular service for free. And I've really enjoyed using it for Smooth and it saved me a couple of hundred pounds a month in Stripe fees. So it's brilliant. Now let's get to it. So I have been sent a link Again, this link was sent to me on the 13th of January. So this is how long ago it's been since I've done this before. So hopefully you can see that I genuinely am just trying to follow Cresco's guide and I don't actually know what I'm doing properly. So I've clicked the link and that has taken me through to zero. So I'm gonna log in now to zero. Just got my two factor authentication set up on my phone, which everyone should have with zero. And I'm going into my coaching business on zero. So now it's taken me back to Cresco and it says confirm zero connection. So because I've got smooth accounting and my coaching business, I wanna make sure that I'm choosing my coaching business, which is what I'm gonna do and click continue. It says the current Cresco organization smooth accounting already has a zero connection. Would you like to create a new Cresco organization for Stop Thinking Like an Accountant Limited? Yes, I would. Okay, it's now taken me to zero invoice integration. Select the bank account to collect payments for your zero invoices. So I've got a button that says add new bank account. So I'm gonna click that. And I actually bank with Tide for my coaching business. So I'm gonna select Tide from the drop down list and confirm. Securely transferring you to Tide to connect bank connection. Okay, now it wants me log to log into my online banking. So with Tide, you scan a QR code. So I'm going to log in on your computer, successfully logged in. I'm gonna select the bank account that I want to link and select grant access. I don't remember doing any of this last time, but obviously I did. So this is genuinely how easy it is to set up. So now it says connected bank accounts. So I just click confirm. 
and it says, please match your Cresco payment account with your Zero bank account. So I'm selecting, now it's asking me which account on Zero I want to link. So I'm selecting my Tide current account and selecting confirm. And it says, select the invoice branding themes in Zero you wish to link with your Cresco online payments. So it's now saying, I've got a standard theme, I've got my auto invoices, or I can select all themes. So I'm going to have it just on my standard theme, which means my invoices that go out now will be able to have a Cresco link on them for people to pay. So I'm gonna select standard theme and continue. And now I'm gonna click confirm. Zero integration complete. Congratulations, your organization is now configured to receive open banking payments with Cresco. Back to dashboard. Literally, that's how easy it is to set up. So it's taken me a few minutes. Okay, so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go into zero and I'm gonna go into my settings and I'm gonna go into payment services and I can see Cresco is sat there now as a connected payment service with my standard theme. Now, if I were to go into invoices and do a new invoice, and if I just do one to smooth accounting, just for you to see, test, I can now email the invoice to myself. And this should have, I hope, the Cresco payment link on it. We will see. There it is. Let's have a look. So I've got a view and pay online now. I'm not actually going to pay this, but let's click it and see where it takes me. It takes me to a copy of the invoice and I've got a pay online button. If I click it, it takes me to Cresco. And I can literally click confirm from the account that I want to pay it from. I'm not going to do that because I don't actually want to pay it, but that just shows you how easy it is. And I've not actually seen it from the customer side like that before. So that's really, really useful for me to see. I'm just going to go back into zero and I'm going to void that invoice because I don't actually want that to be a real invoice. I've taken that off. But yeah, now I can set it up. I can either have Stripe on there or Cresco. I can switch it between the two. But for me, it's an absolute no brainer for Cresco because like I said, it's free and you get paid straight away. If you've got any questions at all, please pop them in the comments below and I'll do my best to answer them. I'm also gonna pop a link in the description for you to sign up to Cresco if you want to. Remember, don't expect any free merch unless you're doing a video. And even then, it's arguable whether you'd get one. Thanks for watching. I hope this has been useful. See you next time.